Hey guys, today we are going to change the oil on my new truck, new to me, 2015 Chevy Silverado LTZ, four wheel drive, 5.3 liter V8. I've had this for about six months and it's time to change the oil. Got the truck up on the blocks, scotch the back wheel back there. And um, what we're gonna do is change it with the new oil, zero W20. Got our filter here and a 15 millimeter socket. So let's get started. All right, so let's slide under here. I'm going under the front. I'm gonna go past the skid plate here. And right here. You can see, I know that's uh, seriously zoomed in. Let's see if we can go smaller. There we go. 15, miller, 15, 15 millimeter bolt there. And you can also see the oil filter. So let's take this off first and let it drain. Got the drain pan right behind me. All right, while that's uh, emptying out, I'm going to go ahead and pop the cap here on top. Let some air uh, pressure from up top help push uh, and release any oil that's sitting within the system. Okay, oil has finished draining, so now we're going to slide back under there and take the oil filter off. Alright, so we've got the oil filter off. One thing I'll point out is I put the drain plug back in and then took the oil filter out. Quite a bit more came out. Next, let's get the new oil filter. We'll put a little oil around the seal, get that back on there before we start pouring the new fresh oil in there. So I went with the K&N oil filter. You can see a little bit of the information there. I just got this off of Amazon as well as the motor oil. Again, OW20 calls for eight quarts, big engine. All right, we're back up here under the truck. And you can see we got the new oil in there. Oil, oil filter installed on the drain plug. Uh, already connected. Um, again, put a little bit of oil around the ring and hand tighten. Um, snug. So let's get back up on top and let's start getting the fresh oil in there. All right, I've already emptied in one container. I've got the second one and again, eight quarts you can use the measurements here on the side so we're going to get three quarts this is a five quart bottle so we'll get down to the two mark here um, and then we should be should be good so i stopped just short of eight quarts probably more like seven and a half then back the truck down off the blocks I'm going to check the oil level on the dipstick there, pull that out, and make sure I'm not overfilling it. So we'll do that next before we put any more oil in. All right, the last thing we got to do is reset the engine oil uh, monitor. So in your truck, we're going to go to, hit the left arrow, we'll go to info. We're going to scroll down till you see oil life push the right button once and then you know hold down for the reset and voila we're back at 100 percent last thing we're going to do which i'm not going to capture on video is recycle your oil save the planet earth do your part anyway hope you found this video helpful if you did like and subscribe